Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Marisa. In today's video, we are going to be doing a project share with the beautiful products I got from CoBeads. So let's get started with the project share. Hey guys, so this is gonna be a quick little video. I just wanna go over real quick. I haven't did the, the last co-beads. This is the last video with the cooperation with co-beads. So first of all, thank you to co-beads very, very much for sending me these products. Um, here are the papers. It was a set of 10 um, right there. Beautiful papers. Here they are all laid out. Here are the stamps. The little key is right there on my acrylic block. And then we have, I had a set of 10 of these adorable little uh, teacup and flower die set mini ones. Very cute. Uh, the reason why all 10 aren't out because I'm, do, I'm sending out some happy mail. I sent some out of the papers and the dies. Alrighty, and well, first of all, the link to CoBeads is in the description below, as well as all three products I'm showing here today. Get the link for this, this beautiful stamp set here, and the dies. And also, I have a coupon code. I'm going to put it right here on the screen. I will also put it in the description. And also, don't forget to check out, uh, when you are checking out their website, they have a lot of coupons, they have a lot of deals, so go, before like, you purchase, just check out their whole website, they have a lot of just sales all the time and discounts, besides my um, discount code, so check that out as well. Woo, all right, I can breathe. So, you saw all the products, so first, what I did was I took a, a whole pack of the, of the papers and again, I am just going to spread them out for you so you could see. So I believe there are five different um, patterns and also then you get five sheets of each pattern. So you get these, it's not, um, what the heck is this called? It's a very thin, pretty white paper. So you have like two different designs with that. And, and it does write very well. I just, I still love the way, and I believe that this sheet kind of matches this in a way, um, but it's the same theme. It's like butterflies and dragonflies and flowers. So you get two um, different designs of the white sheer paper, and then you get three designs. Here's the third one of the um here this this is the one where it's the same print right here and you can layer it like that you can like kind of do it a little off so you can see both that's actually kind of cool all right so that is the paper so what i did was for the first project i whoops my card fell over so sorry all right i took a whole book and I just punched it and I took this cute little green ribbon, put it through and I put some little flower stickers that I had and I made a little notepad. And you could take it with you. This is very cute for little lists. I don't know about a journal, but you know, I think this is kind of very cute for like little notes to yourself, maybe like a mini little dream journal. You could keep this, it's pretty thin. Um, you could keep it right next to your bed. I just thought that was a cute idea. I saw like the whole, it's, it's like a mini pack of paper and they all, you know, they write on very, very well. And I thought it was very pretty and you can embellish it on top of that. I love that, it's so pretty. Look at that detail. And there you go. And here goes the silly people outside beeping their horn. And there that is. So I thought that was a cute little quick idea for the papers. All right. And the second project I did, I made a card. So basically what I suggest is you just run the whole, you don't have to, you can take them apart, but the pieces are so small, you're gonna lose them. So I suggest you just keep it 
all together and run it through your uh, die cut machine like this. That's what I suggest so you don't lose the pieces and it stays all just like that. So <clears throat> I did an envelope and I used that stamp right there just to add a little something to the envelope. And then I made this really pretty card. So I used some dies of obviously that I had in my stash. And here that is, I added this very pretty teacup sticker. And here, whoops, is what it looks like, what the dies look like, all cut out. And I just used, actually I used this paper, I believe I did. Yeah, I probably, probably did, yep. I used just the other side of it because I wanted to use everything in, uh, with all the products in this project. So I used the paper, the back end of this, and I thought this really came out very pretty. And on the inside, I took one of those sheer pieces and I just laid it down right like that. I glued it down. I put some pretty uh, pearl stickers and then I used another sheet of the paper right here the opposite side and I used that stamp let's celebrate you these stamps are really really pretty let me just give you a little close-up the butterfly home the birdcage the beautiful key the birdie and the butterfly so that is a very quick video today with the Kobe. I just did two pro uh, projects and that is it. So don't forget to check out Kobe to have great, um, they have really cute stuff. I found, I'm finding a lot of cute stuff on there. I went back on their website just to check it out. I like to, you know, just go back and see what else is new. So yeah, go and check out their website. It, like I said, all the links to everything will be in the description below, plus my code. Go check it out. Use my code if you want to save a little money. I hope you enjoyed today's quick little project share. And yeah, guys, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching. And thanks again to Kobe's for sending me these beautiful, beautiful products that I will be using. And I was able to gift some. So that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As I said, again, I'm repeating myself. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. It really, really helps out my channel if you do that because YouTube is not sending out notifications. So... <clears throat> Yeah, subscribe, hit that notification bell if you want to see more of my content. And guys, I will see you in the next one. Bye.